Welcome back at 648 here on your Monday morning. Are you in need of a job or maybe just feeling overwhelmed or discouraged by your job search? Or maybe you're just looking at for a way to stand out among applicants. Well, as part of our dedication to helping you through these effects of the coronavirus and helping you rebound from it all, we wanted to provide you with a little advice, both from a job searching expert and a man who has lived it firsthand. Here's more in this edition of The Rebound Kentucky. Like so many, Sam Crouch's life has changed during the coronavirus. I think I realized my days were numbered at the job I was at. In March, he was on Indeed, searching for jobs from his home in Frankfurt, snagged an interview, and was fortunate enough to get hired during a pandemic. And all of it happened over a computer. I interviewed over Zoom because um, they're based in Minnesota and uh, got the position. Um, my first three days of training were on Zoom. So that was a different experience, just learning from PowerPoints the whole time. Normally, his training would have consisted of two weeks of on-site and in-person instruction, but he adapted, rolled with the punches, and has now been working full-time ever since. And it's this kind of flexibility and determination Krinda Frankie, president and CEO of Lexington's Executrain, says you need to have if you're in the search for a job right now. You've got to have grit and you've got to have perseverance and you really just got to be patient and just keep doing the work. Her company has been incredibly busy through the coronavirus, consistently placing people in jobs the entire time and adapting to the ever changing world. And we're hiring people that we meet through Zoom. We've never even had face-to-face -face contact, you know, besides the, the computer screen. So what is her advice on getting a job right now? Number one, she says get on LinkedIn. Frankie says 90% of employers use the website to hire. And you've got to make sure that that profile really speaks to your strengths and talents. So let's see, what are some strengths that would be desirable right now? Resilience creativity, knowing that in previous positions you were faced with challenges. Frankie says even now in the age of social distancing, networking remains key. She says using LinkedIn as a tool for that is extremely helpful as well. Another thing to help you stand out, Frankie says make sure you are tailoring your cover letters and resumes for that particular company or position. You can tell that that person spit out one resume and one cover letter and sent it to 100 different employers for possibly 50 different positions. It's so completely obvious. So taking that extra time and effort to really invest in yourself via your resume and what it presents will really pay off dividends. And finally, she urges job searchers to show an employer how you can help them represent yourself as someone that can come in and help be creative, can help you reposition your company. Many companies have had to completely redesign the way they do business. So a quick summary, make a LinkedIn profile and make sure it shows off your strengths. Network, don't be boring. Show off your personality via Zoom and your resumes and cover letters. And of course, don't get discouraged. Remember, many industries are hiring right now, like grocery stores, pharmacies, and telework. And take it from Sam Crouch, the persistence pays off. It's possible. I mean, I was able to find a job. Um, I stayed persistent in the pursuit of trying to find a different job. And ExecuTrain is offering a variety of free online classes right now to help you in your job search, help you boost your resume, or even help you gain or sharpen some skills that you may already have. For more information on that, just head on over to that website, lex18.com slash rebound. You can also find lots of other resources to help you, your family, or your business rebound from the coronavirus.